What are those? What are those? <laughs> Welcome to a brand new uh, Life Beyond Tech vlog, and I'm just opening up this vlog watching my little deer outside. And yes, this is Baltimore. Hey, so, um, I keep forgetting that I'm supposed to be vlogging sometimes, so <laughs> I already started this project, so we're coming in, um, I haven't started too much, I just put in the first group. So we're coming in with me actually, you know, hanging a shelf here in my kitchen because I just want like a little shelf so I can sit my phone up. So when I'm cooking and things like that, I'm always like putting my phone on the countertop or over here on the stand. So I figured just like a cute little shelf right here will be good and right here near the plug so I can plug it in if I need to, if I need to charge it or whatever that I can just sit my phone on. Sometimes I like to watch YouTube if I'm following like a recipe that I found on YouTube. Like it'll be good to like have my phone up so that I can actually like see what's happening as I'm doing it. So yeah, let's hang the shelf. So I have a little shelf that I used to keep um, in the bathroom, just a small little shelf that I will sit stuff on. So I'm actually just gonna move it out here. Uh, so I have my power drill. Um, I have my different like screws and bits and things like that. So yeah, I'm just now measuring everything out. I already measured it out with my, this is a level and um, a tape measure. So I love using this and it just helps to level everything out. So yeah, I'm just going to, let me move you guys closer. Okay, I'm back. So here's my little shelf. And I just got these. It's it came in like a pack of like small, medium, and large. And I think I got these from either Target or Walmart. Um, one or the other. So this is just a little shelf. Um, and then it has these words. It, one of them says love. I think one of them says faith or something. So they're the ones that you're supposed to stack next to each other. I just have them in different places. So you just take this part. And you just slide it right in so it looks just like that and then it has the openings on the back so you just put it right in cooking I'm cooking I'm cooking and I mean I can see the phone fine but I'm just trying to think like when I'm cooking cooking um the phone isn't going to be sitting like that so I'm cooking I mean I guess having it really high up isn't that big of a deal it'll be out of the splash zone so that's good. And I mean, it's not that bad up here. I can still see. I mean, my glasses are... <laughs> my glasses are foggy. So it's making everything look super uh. But for the most part... For the most part, I can see. So it's not like I can't see. I can. Um... So do I want to move it or not? I mean, it wasn't hard to put it in, so I could technically move it down. But at the same time, I like to put things, yeah, you know what? No, I'm going to leave it because 
my paper towels go right here so I've only been able to move it down but so much so you know what I'm just gonna leave it because yeah it gives me enough clearance when I need to put stuff here so it's not in the way so yes it's a winner I'm gonna leave it where it is all right so I'm gonna leave it right there and let me put you guys back sorry I'm gonna leave it right where it is. Put you guys back. So yeah, I'm just gonna leave it where it is. Um, and then, so typically I have um, I have things hanging here. So as you can see, I have like these little my little makeshift. Um, my little makeshift hooks is literally just thumbtacks. I know, I know. But that's me, guys. It is what it is. Like, I just do stuff like this. Like, I mean, the thumbtack works. If it ain't broken, why am I gonna fix it? There's no reason for me to fix it if it's not broken. Put the other thumbtack here because that's where my cutting shears, my scissors go when I'm cutting up meat and things like that. And of course, I put it in crooked. What's with me and putting in things crooked? Ugh. So my scissors hang there. Um, my one of my. Okay, sorry, I had to free up some storage on my phone. So my measuring cups just hang here, which is perfectly fine. The clearance is good. I don't remember where it was on these two. No, my potato pillow was on here, which I don't know why, because I never keep it up there. I always keep it in the drawer. So I don't even know what what was originally right here. So honestly, those two are just there. Um, so that doesn't matter. And then my oven mitts just go on the rest of them. So yeah, the clearance is good. The little love sign just goes in there and then I can just like remove that so that it's not visually in the way. So it's like when I want to actually like see the phone, I can just take this out, which is good. Um, so yeah, that's my little, um, that's my little thing for the day, right? My little, um, my little project is done. So yeah. Hung my love sign. Let's get you guys a good view. You can see it. Da, da, da. So, yeah. Um, this is what it is. And I love this drill. It's super easy. It's the Galax Pro um, handheld drill driver. And I want to say I got this from... I want to say I got this from... Um, from let me see where did I get this from I want to say I got this from Best Buy that's what I want to say I could be wrong but I think I got this from I said Best Buy Lord my brain Home Depot I believe I got this from Home Depot you guys <laughs> so I think I got this from Home Depot um very easy very simple to use as you can see just handheld I have a ton of like, I have a ton of screws and bits. This isn't even the beginning of it. I have like literally tons and tons of these. Um, these were just, you know, previously used by someone and now they belong to me. So yeah, now I'm going to just, all right, let me turn you guys around. Okay. Um, so now i'm just gonna clean up the kitchen a little bit i have to um empty, empty the dishwasher get the the dishes that are in the sink loaded into the dishwasher clean up the kitchen a little bit um it's like it's almost one o'clock and literally i got up super late today i slept in i slept because i got home late last night and i got home like 12 30 a.m something like that so I ended up sleeping in late today. So I'm actually just getting my day started. But yeah, 
Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna clean up the kitchen and then make myself something to eat and then just sit on the couch and like binge some TV. Um, so yeah, I'll probably just see you guys tomorrow, honestly. I don't, I don't really have anything else that I'm doing today that, you know, you don't, I don't gotta vlog sitting on the couch. I don't think I do. Um, but yeah, so I'm just going to, you know, do these things around the house and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Okay, I lied, I'm back. So let me give you guys an update on the breaks. I know you guys are probably sick of hearing about these breaks, but until we get them fixed, y'all gonna keep hearing about them. So, boom, this is what happened. In last week's vlog, make sure you go watch last week's vlog. Last week's vlog, you guys see me talking about my breaks. My breaks need to be fixed badly. Um, you see me go to the guy, I'm talking to the guy about my breaks, all that good stuff. He says he can fix them. The price is, the price is better than what I've been hearing. You know, he's the lowest so far. Um, as of right now, I haven't gotten my breaks fixed because even though it was in last week's vlog, for me, it was just yesterday because I'm starting this vlog a little bit early. Usually I start the vlog on Mondays, but I'm actually starting this vlog on Sunday. Um, so last week's vlog yeah so yesterday was saturday you guys saw me go with him go to him do all that stuff i talked to you about getting my brakes fixed i came home spent a ton of time looking for my brakes because i need brake pads and i need rotors for front and back which is why it's so expensive girl anyway so i'm searching i'm searching i'm searching i'm like comparing sites finally found some that was a good price and Boom, I order them, right? I wake up this morning, ugh, ugh, I'm nice and happy. I'm texting, having a good morning. You know, I slept in, I got enough rest. I'm energized now, I'm feeling good. Open up my email and it's always something. So I open up my email and I see that where I ordered the parts from, they're like, um my brakes are not in stock front and rear why you got update your website up your inventory should match your website and as a web developer this is a huge pet peeve of mine these people their inventory and their website never match the database and the website there should be a log when something's going out your database, even in stores, just like your in-store, your, your database should be updated. Check, check. We have two left. Oh, look at that. Two people bought this. One, two, gone. We have zero left. Your website should show that it's out of stock. I really hate that. So they email me and they're like, out of stock. So they did a partial refund for my breaks and then i get emails saying that my rotors are being shipped don't ship me rotors and without breaks thank you very much so i have to go in and manually cancel and request the refund for the rotors even though they shipped it already i'm like mm -mm, y'all gonna take this back because while i don't need rotors <laughs> why would i need rotors and not need breaks that's not even how cars work. You can need brakes without rotors, but nine times out of 10, and I would go as far as saying 10 times out of 10, if your rotors are worn, your brake pads are worn too, seeing as though that's the first to go. So you canceling my brakes and you sending me rotors. Get out of my face, please. So I had to go in and I had to manually request a refund. So as soon as these rotors arrive, they are going back in the mail, straight back to these people. Thank you. Take your stuff back because I don't want half an order. I'm like, y'all ask me for my email address. Y'all ask me for my phone number. Hello, Miss Moore. We don't have your bricks in stock. We will only have the rotors. Would you like the rotors to be sent? And would you like to purchase new, another set of brakes? Or would you like to cancel this entire order? Hey, so it's much later in the day and I'm about to make dinner. I'm actually gonna make myself a salad. So I'm gonna make a salad with just cut up um, chicken in it. So chicken nuggets though, because I don't feel like actually cooking chicken chicken. So I just made nuggets and then I'm just gonna cut those up, put it in the salad.
still in the couch. I'm rewatching The Crown from the beginning. I absolutely love that show. And when I started watching it, because I've been telling my sister about it for a long time, and I've been telling her to watch it. Um, and I started rewatching it from season one yesterday when I was at her house so she can get started on it. So now I'm just like back into the crown mode. So I'm just rewatching the crown from season one. Absolutely love that show. If you have not seen the crown, definitely highly recommend. It's a very good show. Hello. So today's Monday, ignore my hair. It looks terrible. I'm just gonna put my cap on since my hair looks so bad. Let me put you guys right here. Alrighty. Today is Monday and I'm on my way out of the house. I have some stores to go to. Uh, so my sister just came to pick me up and we're going to do some running around really quickly. I got to pick up some things for my party this weekend. And she has some stores that she needs to go to. Come on now, bro. She has some stores that she needs to go to as well. So, oh. so we're going to get out of the house. It's Monday. It's a holiday. It is President's Day. So, there shouldn't be like too much traffic with people out and about. People should be in the homes, in their homes, enjoying their day off. So, I'm just going to put on my Adidas hat because my hair is not done properly. I have on my Adidas shirt and then my Adidas sweats with my Crocs. So, that's my fit. Hold on. Let me make sure I got my wallet. Yeah. I got my wallet. I don't need anything else, right? No, I don't need anything else. Let me grab my keys. My sister is outside waiting on me. I don't even know what she just asked me, but mm. I responded. Alright, so I'm in the car with my sister. Oh my gosh. The one who'll be ducking my vlog. Really? You just, I'm going to just look up and be on the camera. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> That's exactly what's going to happen. So I'm in the car and we're about to just run around different stores and do what we need to do. So I'm just gonna take you guys with me because I'm usually in the house. So when I get out of the house, I at least wanna add some content to the vlog. <laughs> so I'm gonna take y'all with me as we go to different stores. Uh, but for now, we're just in the car. So I'll see you guys when we get to our first store. I'm looking a mess. All right, so this stuff is my sister's. She is doing her tree for St. Patrick's Day. Um, so we decided to turn the party also into a color theme so my sister chose blue so this is all her stuff so we're going to do a color theme party so everybody is going to wear a color and you have to bring the stuff bring stuff that matches your color that's creepy that's super creepy i do have to buy one for peyton too because i'm giving her some natalie clothes Oh, okay. I'm just giving her two of them because I had like five. Yeah. I'm like, girl, she didn't read all. <sighs> okay, this truck became way more than any. For you. Finding you boxes, I guess going to Michael's. Yeah, this is we was in the Dollar Tree for way too long. It's now 1223. Let's see if they advance auto parts real quick. Huh? Front and rear. Yeah. Front and rear. Yeah. You have the parts already? I'm I'm buying the parts from online. Okay. From advance? Mm -hmm. Um, whichever is cheaper. Going in until I'm putting it on my um, on my name, my discount. Okay. I can get started on another one. This oh no, it's not this car. Can you bring it up here? 
Yeah. How long you gonna be out here? Okay. Okay. How much? Normally it'll be three hundred, one fifty for the front, one fifty for the back. Okay. All right. Thank you. Okay. Thanks. This TJ is a small. And he got a suitcase. I do need another, a new carry on. Because my wheels are wonky. We're really just being here getting everything for what I'm supposed to get. Pretty much. My wheels are wonky. Child, I ain't got no boxes in here. <laughs> they do though. I like this. This yeah. is cute. Yeah, that's super cute. Nice. It's only one fifty. I like that. Mm -hmm. This one's on sale. How much? One twenty. It's still cute though. This one's on sale for one twenty. Not real wood. Yeah. Oh, you guys have for forty bucks. We don't need those chairs. How much this one is? This one's only fifty nine. I need chairs in my living room. These are cute. Yeah, they are. These are super cute. Yeah. These are super cute. Yeah, these are cute. Well, if we didn't have stuff in there, you could. Cause you, ooh, ooh, that's nice. Can I get them in my trunk? Yeah, you I can could. Really get them today. Right if you put the seats down, yeah. Well, this is nice. Come sit in it. Seriously. I don't know. It feels good, right? I like this. It's cute. They match the gold. I mean, the yep. gray. They do. They feel good. They do feel good. They're comfy. <laughs> the boxes. One more box is all we need. That one kind of smells like cedar. These candles smell so good. Yeah, they do. They're nice and tight. I was trying to find it in green to match the St. Patrick's Day. Oh, yeah, true. But. I like that smell, but this one's much bigger. Oh my god. I like that. It's not bad. You smell it. <laughs> Come. It's pretty good though. It's not bad. It is $7.99. This one's good. Oh, here it is. I like this packaging. Yeah, true. This packaging is cute. Tree idea though, it's yeah. cute. I mean, I'm gonna save everything, it's not like I'm gonna wear it. Right. Hey, so I'm just at my sister's house and we're working on a project. 
we are blinking out some stuff. So I'm gonna show you guys what we're working on really quickly. So this is what we're working on. We're blinging out this um, silk robe. So it's gonna be really nice and pretty. It's a gift for someone. So we're just blinging that out. And it's gonna be super cute. That's so pretty. It says beautiful in the sunshine. That looks really good. All right, so we have the gift boxes all put together. This is the cute box that everything is being shipped in. And then this is the robe and underneath of it, there's a bunch of different gifts under here. Y'all don't need to see all that. But yeah, it looks really pretty, right? So she putting some stuff up for our little I'm decorating their St. Patty's Day tree. Because they are keeping their tree up for all of the major holidays. You guys missed Valentine's Day. I actually should have showed you that one. Um, but Valentine's Day just got taken down. And now St. Patrick's Day is up. She's making banana bread. This is my niece. Sis be baking. <laughs> Got the banana bread. Taste test time. Oh, comes in my eye. It is a perfect mm. day for a Hey, so it's Tuesday morning and I'm just going to take you guys along with me as I work from home. So like a little mini day in my life as I'm working from home. So the first thing I do is I get up early in the morning, you know, do what I need to do. And then I make some tea and I am just like picking out what I want to wear. So if I'm working from home, I do like to be comfy. Um, so sometimes I wear just like a t-shirt and some leggings or like some sweats or whatever. So I'm just going to pick out what I need to wear and then I'm just going to put myself together. Um, my hair is in shambles, but you know, it's whatever. <laughs> I'm going to be taking these out soon. Um, so I've just been modifying it and making it look presentable. So I'm just like doing my hair, getting ready, um, putting on this headband so that I can actually like hide what the what's really happening underneath there. Um, but yeah, I just like to get ready. It's early in the morning. I want to say it's like probably six something in the morning right now. So I'm going to go ahead and make my tea because I really love having tea in the morning. I like having tea like at any time of day, but especially in the morning it helps me to, you know, wake up and get my day started. So typically I will drink the, um, chai tea in the morning. That's my favorite to drink. It has, um, vanilla in it and yeah i really like it and i drink it with the unsweetened almond milk that's just my favorite way to do it uh so i have my tea and then after that then i just go ahead and i head to my office so once i get into my office then it is time for me to actually log in and get my day started so i'll go to my office and as you can see i need to clean up that room um my office is a mess 
but I just like to go ahead and like log in and get my day started. There's plenty of things that I need to do on this day. Um, and I have a lot of meetings that I need to be in. You guys know what it's like to be inside of those tech meetings. Um, so yeah, I do have meetings that I need to sit through. I don't necessarily have to talk in all of them, but I do have to sit through them. Um, so while other people are talking, I'll like turn off my camera and then go and get some breakfast because it doesn't really concern me at that point. So here I'm just going to go ahead and make myself some oatmeal. Oatmeal is a good energy booster in the morning and I just add like a little bit of brown sugar and it just helps me to get my day started after I have my tea. It's good to have something hot in your body, right? Um, so I just go ahead and I make my oatmeal for the day and this is my morning. I go ahead and I eat my oatmeal and then while my oatmeal is being eaten, I just go right back into my office and I sit down and um, I'm just listening to the rest of the meeting. Like I said, I don't have much to contribute to this meeting in particular. Um, when I do, I just like turn my camera back on or turn my video back on, my video, um, my audio back on and I say what I need to say. But otherwise, I'm just doing a lot of listening and I'm not on camera. So this is a morning in my life when I'm working from home on a typical day. Hey, so it's later in the day. I am about to be done with work in like 45 minutes or so. Um, I'm not actually doing anything really right now, but I'll be off in like 45 minutes. <laughs> but, okay, so one thing that I have going on right now is I am preparing to take the cybersecurity, I'm sorry, that view was not it. I'm preparing to take the cybersecurity exam, right? So I'm currently studying, well, let me backtrack. Let me backtrack. I'm not currently studying. I'm about to be studying. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna sit down and I'm going to, um, I already just, I already, I got a study plan for myself um with the help of a friend of mine she helped me come up with a really good study plan so i have a study plan for myself that i'm going to stick to so i have a schedule i'm going to stick to so i make sure i hit my targets every single day make sure that i'm staying on task with studying uh, so what i'm about to do right now is i'm going to prep and um just put together like a manual for myself so like all of the course material that I can download and like things like that and just like put it all together in like a study guide like a, a bundle so I'm about to sit down and do that because it's now 208 and I start my studying in an hour so I'm going to be studying starting at three o'clock so what I'm going to be doing also is I'm going to be going I'm going to do a separate video which is not going to be up yet you're definitely going to see this video first so I'm going to do a video I uh, pretty much chronicling my um study journey for cybersecurity and um taking you guys along with me okay so um yeah i got a phone call so it interrupted my my thought process so yeah i'm actually going to be chronicling my studying as i go through the course and prepare for the exam everything that i do to prepare for this exam and then I'll be taking you guys with me when I actually take the exam. All right, so I'll just give you a quick little sneak peek if you can see that. So what I'm doing right now is, you know, let me turn the screen around. Duh. Okay, so I'm doing the ISC um, Squared Certified Cybersecurity Self-Paced um, course. So this is a course that I see squared has um so I'm enrolled in this and I will be going through all of the modules and just like studying um learning all of this and then going ahead and actually taking the exam once I'm done okay okay so like I was saying, so I am, one thing about me is that 
naturally I am a procrastinator. It is something that I've dealt with for forever. It's literally something that I have to like create plans for myself and strategies for myself so that I don't procrastinate like or else I'll just go take a nap instead of actually <laughs> instead of actually getting what I need to get done done. I'll just sleep it off right and just put it off until tomorrow. Everything can wait until tomorrow in my brain except obviously that's not true. So because I naturally procrastinate, I did enroll in this course a long time ago. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I enrolled in this course a while ago. I did get through, a, it doesn't even matter. That little teeny part that I got through don't even matter because I got to start all over again because I forgot all of it anyway. So pretty much I'm starting from square one. The only problem is that I have had six months, almost six months access to this course. I now have about three weeks access left. So I have three weeks to go through this course, get the studying done. <laughs> it is crunch time. Okay. It's crunch time. So I'm going to take you guys along with me as I get this done in three weeks. Um, and I'm going to do it because I'm brilliant. Um, so yeah, I'm going to do it. It's not good to do things this way, but I work good under pressure. Okay? Policy to handle any liability claims. This allows us to transfer our risk to another party. The insurance company is taking the gamble that our premiums and those of other businesses will bring in more income than a potential claim would make them pay out. So... Okay, so it's been two and a half hours. So I studied for that long. And I really like the um I really like the timer that I'm using. The um what? Oh, somebody's texting me. I really like the timer. The twenty minutes with the five minute breaks. That's like a perfect that's like a perfect timer for me because sitting longer than that really would just like you know and the five minute breaks is perfect because it doesn't take much like you don't need to you don't need that long to like walk around stretch use the bathroom really quickly if you need to so what i ordered from amazon i'll show you guys so i ordered the taco holders these are super cute. I found these on Amazon. They were really inexpensive on Amazon. They come 12 in a pack. So I ordered two packs. So I got 24 of them. And they're just taco holders. See? Because like I really hate when you try and put tacos on a plate. Like it's a taco. It's going to fall over. Um, so I don't, I, I don't like that. So... I can't stand when I have to try and put tacos on a plate and it just like keeps toppling over. It really bugs me. So everything bugs me. So yeah, I got these little taco holders. They just sit just like that. And of course they have the opening and then you just like put your taco right in it. There you go. So Amazon, they were like five something for 12 of these. So the good thing is that they are color. So I'll try and like, if I can, give everybody a color because i think nah it's not gonna match everybody's color so whatever um that would be pretty cool though if it would match everybody's colors but yeah so i have these um taco holders and then for the murder mystery okay so i had two options one i was going to do like they have that um that murder mystery like it's it's not really a game but i guess it's a game it's like where you you get case files and you're like so there's two you get the case files and you're the detective and you're reading over the case files and you have to actually like solve the crime based on the case files and then there's another one where um you guys are sort of like the participants in the murder so everyone takes on a character and you know one of you you one of you gets murdered or something like that so 
Um, those were the two options that I, that I found online. The problem with that is, and the reason why I didn't get those was because after you solve the crime, it is what it is. You can't use it again. So it's like, it's not like you get an infinite number of case files. Like the case files that they send you is what you get. So once you solve the murder, the game that you bought is completely useless. So because of that, I decided to get Clue instead. Trusty old Clue. Why? Because Clue is a game that you can keep playing over and over again because, you know, it's a board game. Um, so, yeah, I figure this will get more uses for my money than the case files, even though I really do like that case files idea. Like, it's super fun and I might end up getting that at some point anyway. But I didn't like the fact that once you get it and you solve it, that's it. Like, game over. I mean, I guess you could resell it or something. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, I just decided to go ahead and get Clue because, um, yeah, I figured Clue will be super fun. We'll have a lot of fun playing games. My family loves playing board games. Literally, we're super hyper competitive. It is not for the weak around here. Like, and a lot of times I am the weak. I gotta admit, like a lot of times I am. So um, I'm the weak a lot of times, but I do my best. Um, but we love board games, very competitive. It gets massively ignorant. Um, and you gotta you gotta reel those personalities in because my family, it's a lot of us. We're very big. Um, and they get stupid, like they get real stupid. <laughs> so um, Clue should actually be fun because they're nuts. So th we're gonna have a lot of fun with this. So Clue is the murder mystery part. I got my little tacos for the taco and then everybody, you know, is going to do their color. I'm gonna make you look like, hey, she cares. Um, so. I love wearing these headbands. Um, but yeah. So, let's get moving. I need to blow my nose. I'm gonna bring my water with me. Some tissues. My nose is always running because of my allergies. So. <clears throat> All right. So I have my water. I have my tissues and I have my allergies. Sorry, you guys were mad close just now. I have my allergies. <laughs> and um, I have my allergy. I have my tissues because of my allergies. Like my nose is always running. So I have a empty tissue box. I'm just gonna refill with some tissues because I bought I bought a tissue box yesterday. Well not yesterday, but the other day. So I'm just gonna refill this one. So I like to keep those tissue boxes around the house because my nose is always running. Hold on, let's see if I can sit you guys down right there. Stay there. Because my nose is always running. And I bought some new chapstick as well. I have a million and one of these of chapsticks and I like to just keep chapsticks all, over, all in my purse. So it's not just lip gloss all the time. Um. How do I break the seal, guys? How do I break the seal? Oh, oh. All right, so. Moisturize my lips. And I'm running, okay, time is going. So, so that I'm not um, running out of time, I'm going to get off of this vlog because I really actually have to do a good, some solid studying time. 
and before I actually cross over into starting to work and you guys are distracting me so actually I'm going to um I'm gonna get started but I'll be back periodically all right bye All right, so I'm done my first study session, my first morning study session. Um, I'm about to hop back on the laptop. I had to get me some tea. Um, yeah, I had to get some tea. So I just finished an hour of studying. So I changed my schedule up a little bit because I was going to do two hours in the morning before work and then two hours after work. Instead of doing that, I'm going to do an hour in the morning before work and then an hour during lunch. And then two hours after work and it, that's more manageable for me because I'm not a super 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 early bird so I don't want to try and force myself to do something that I'm not actually going to stick with so one hour before work is perfect for me that way I can get up at like um, 6 a.m. make sure I'm getting enough sleep get up at like 6 a.m. and then um, you know study before work study for about study for an hour before work um and then start work on my lunch break I usually just like watch tv or something or work on something or work through lunch anyway so um I'm just going to study through lunch and then after work I take like a little a quick little break like 15 minute break and then I get right back to studying so this is definitely doable um i feel good about it so yeah i'm actually about to get back into my office <laughs> all right head back into my office and get ready for work i just need to get me some tea really quickly but I'm about to log on and start working in a few minutes. I have a few minutes before I need to log on. So I'm going to sit here. I'm going to sip on my tea. And yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Have a little like five minute relaxation before I actually start work. So yeah, I'll pick you guys back up later. Bye. Okay, so I'm done with work. Um, I'm done for the day, yay! I studied, I just logged out. I'm good to go, I'm ready to prep for my party. Um, in the meantime, I need to actually go outside to my car and um, I need to go outside to my car and actually put these papers on I need to put these papers on um, put a coat on. I need to put these papers on my on my boxes to go to FedEx. Oh, are you guys gonna stay here or no? Stay right here. So I gotta go to FedEx, like I said earlier, and I'm going to actually, they sent me, the car people sent me, um, shoot. The car people sent me the return shipping labels. So I gotta return everything to them. They sent me the return shipping labels. So I'm just gonna run out to my car really quickly and put the shipping labels on.
right, so I got my shipping labels. I'm gonna put them right back here. I have my boxes from FedEx. This is one. This is two. So I just need to cover the original label with the new shipping label. And I need to make sure that I'm putting the correct one on as well. All right, so I moved inside because it's cold out there. Okay, I'm back. I had to figure out which label went on which box because I don't want them playing any games. So um, now I know which label goes on which box. Let me try and set you guys back up. <laughs> out really quickly nothing complicated just some simple pants to put on um i'm just gonna put on some sweats super easy no complications um one day i might give like a closet tour because i have like hell of clothes literally clothes over here Those over here. I might do a closet tour, possibly. But yeah, I'm just gonna put on some black sweats, my black Adidas, which are up here. My black Adidas, which need to be cleaned. So yeah, I'm just gonna toss this on really quickly because my sister is just waiting for my nephew to get home from school. So once he gets home, she's gonna come over here and pick me up. And then she's going to take me because, of course, remember my car, I still need to get my brakes fixed in my car. So because I haven't fixed my brakes yet, I'm not driving my car just yet um, until I replace those brakes because they're grinding really badly and I don't want to cause further damage to it. So for now, I just have my car parked. I still need to find a mechanic um, to replace these brakes for me. So until that happens... My sister doesn't live far from me. She lives like five minutes from me, possibly. So it's just easy for her to come and get me. And thankfully, I have a wonderful sister who is willing to pick me up and drive me around when I need to. Um, so yeah. So yeah, my sister's just going to come and get me. So I'm going to go and get dressed. And then I'll see you guys probably like when I jump in the car with her. So we have here. And there's this one also. Yeah, both of these. Um, they have two separate, yeah, two separate tracking numbers and everything on them. Do you guys sell your brand boxes? Yes, we do. Yeah, um, we can do it in line. We can do it in line or we can do it with people purchasing. Um, how much? Um, I can do it with people purchasing. Your tracking numbers are right here and right here. Okay, thank you so much. Oh, whatever. We're together today. Are you though? What? I'm just joking. <laughs> There's some ghetto happenings in Walmart. Ghetto happenings in Walmart. This is why I love it here. I know that's why y'all don't. But this is why I do. We are just getting out of the Walmart. Literally, we were in Walmart for that long. It's now dark out. Yeah, now we gotta rush to the hair store to buy so that I can get my hair done and my niece can get her hair done. But yeah, we were in Walmart for that long. Madness. All right, so I just got home. I am going to take my medicine really quickly. And then I'm going to run back out 
because I have to run back out of the house and go to Rite Aid. So um, I'm going to take my medicine and then I'm going to take my medicine and then I'm going to run back out of the house and go to Rite Aid because my sister's in the car waiting for me. It's been a crazy past few hours and my phone is has been dying. My phone is full of storage. I haven't really been able to fully vlog, but we're going to work this out. Hi. I'm just gonna get this. That's it? Yep, that's it. Write your phone number. Hey, so I'm just now getting home not too long ago. Threw my night clothes on, getting ready for bed. Um, I was gonna attempt to clean, but I'm not going to. It, that's just ridiculous. I'm gonna get some sleep and then wake up tomorrow morning and clean um, because it's like one something in the morning now. And yeah, let me show you guys this table. So yeah, I have all the stuff on the table that I need to clean up. Um, all the stuff that I had to grab from the store. So I'm gonna clean all of that. And then I just have to um, clean the house tomorrow. Get ready for the party make sure everything is spotless um but yeah so i'm actually on my way to bed so i will talk to you guys tomorrow good morning it is saturday and i have a lot to get done today i have to take my hair out stuff my hair my twist um, i have to wash my hair i have to style my hair because i was going to get my hair done but I got home so late that literally I'm just going to get it done next weekend. So I'm still going to do my hair. I'm just not going to get the faux locks in. Um, yeah, I have to do all of that. I still have to clean my entire place in preparation for my party tomorrow. Make sure I have everything. Make sure I'm not forgetting anything. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to be cleaning up a lot of the day. And then I'm going to, I'm going to clean first. And then I'm going to do my hair second. That way my hair is, you know, nice and fresh. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to get up. And I'm just going to take you guys with me today as I clean probably. And then uh, later on when my party starts. <music>
Okay, so I'm about to pick out my clothes. My color is pink. Uh, because everybody is wearing a color because it is part of the theme is also color party, right? So my color is pink. Um, I do have pink pants that I haven't worn in forever. So let's do that. Let's do the pink pants. And then I have pink tops. I have pink tops. So. So I keep my clothes color coordinated and also sectioned off pants, tops. So I can always just go right to the pink section. And I have a bunch of pink here, but I think I'm just gonna wear this one. It's just a simple pink hoodie. And if I get warm or too hot, then I can always take it off. Cause I mean, I'm at my house, so. So yeah, I'm just gonna wear this hoodie, those pink pants. And then I have pink Adidas slides and a little pink headband. So I'll be all pinked out. Okay, so I'm finally about to start cooking. It is um, like 420 something, 426. And I'm gonna start cooking now. Perfect timing so that um, I, I didn't wanna start the food too, too early. So this is actually the perfect time. So I am actually going to cook. I don't have time to worry about vlogging while I cook. So, um, I'll show you guys a quick picture of what I'm making. Um, I have shrimp, I have ground turkey, and I have the chicken in the fridge for the fajitas. So that's what I'm going to have. I'm going to have um, regular tacos, except for instead of beef, I'm going to have ground turkey. Um, hard shell tacos, soft shell tacos with shrimp tacos, and, and then chicken fajitas. And I also have the um, water boiling for the rice because in case anybody wants to make like a bowl, if they don't want to like eat a shell or anything like that, I wanted to have like a rice base. So like Chipotle style. Um, so yeah, I'm about to start cooking and I'll show you the finished results. So, this is black. Hey. We got brown. They're red. Happy birthday. We got the red. Welcome in. Uh, all right. All right. Auntie Joe don't have no thing. I got shredded letters right there. I don't have a thumb. It's just so It's just so It's just so No, that's just tomatoes. So that's I cut up a fresh tomato. That's onions and peppers. Okay. I cut up a fresh tomato in case you guys didn't want the jar tomato. I'm sure. You're like one inch taller. Don't eat a bug. How heavy are you? I was going to pay the table so you can have like a, 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 a what's the quick date? I just didn't really need I got bands. No, 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 no. That's crazy. How many? Can I want to get bands? Wait, who got bands? Luke's? Yep. I got bands. If I got UT, if I got UT channel, I'm going to. Did you drink some bands? No, that's why I said when the game started, that's why I was like, okay, so a party, it must have been a party game. Shut up. Did you drink some bands? Did you drink some bands? Oh my God. I know who did it. I know what happened. I know what happened. I know who did it. So as you can see, my family is massively loud and we get together and we have the best time. We always have so much fun together. And I like to throw these little parties at my house for my birthday every year, typically. Um, just like a quick little get together just for my family. We always come together, my mom, my sisters, my brothers, my nieces, my nephews. And we just have a great time and my brother-in-law is there as well. My oldest brother couldn't make it because he had something else to do. But we always have a great time. Literally, we come over and it's just us crowded around um, and we get like super loud. Forgive, I hope my neighbors can forgive me always, but we always have the absolute best time. Here in this clip, we are trying to figure out who done it because a part of the party theme was murder mystery. And my oldest sister is the person who got killed. As you can see, she is over there dead and Nobody knew what was going to happen besides me and one of my brothers. So when she passed out on the table, they really thought that she passed out for real. So they were actually really scared. Um, so she had to wake up really quickly and let them know that it was just a part of the game. Um, and they, we continued the game and they continued trying to guess who actually killed her. 
and how they killed her. So that's what we're doing right now. I already know the answer and one of my brothers knows the answers. Um, but yeah, everyone is like making guesses and they're like super loud. I know my neighbors were like, what is going on? But anyway, we always have such a great time. And it turns out that my nephew, her son, is the one who actually killed her in this little mystery. Um, but yeah, we had a very, very good time. And I absolutely love celebrating my birthday with my family. Chicken fingers. Which one is Oh, you got to clean. So later on, after all of the madness, um, uh, we sat down and we played the game Clue. This is a really fun game to play at any family game night. So a part of the murder mystery was playing Clue and my brother right there in the orange shirt, he ended up winning right before I was going to win, but whatever. Happy Sunday. It's my birthday. Mm, 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 mm. Wake it up, wake it up, wake it up. Wake it up, wake it up on my birthday. Yay. So today is my actual birthday. Yesterday I had my party with my family. We had so much fun. It was a blast. It was a murder mystery, taco themed color party. So three things, but we had so much fun. Um, the end of the night playing Clue. Uh, yeah, I had a good time. Today is my actual birthday. So today I'm just going to chill, relax. I still got to take my hair out, wash my hair. I still got to do that. I'm not going to do that till later though. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to relax today. Probably take, um, I probably will run out to the store really quickly. Um, just to, because I didn't get myself a cake yesterday and I want to get myself a cake. So I'm probably just going to run up the street really quickly to the supermarket, grab myself a cake, um, come right back home because I, I'm not really, I'm not going to actually do anything, I don't think, today. Um, but yeah, it's my birthday. Oh, my supermarket sold these little mini individual cakes. Aren't they super cute? And it's vanilla. They're super cute. Look. Um... I forgot to get candles, but I don't need all that. I'm good. But yeah, so I got these super cute little mini cakes. So I wouldn't have to get like a half a cake or a whole cake because it's just me um, today. And I'm not going to eat all of that cake. So yeah, I'm just going to start making breakfast. Uh, maybe I'll take you guys with me. Maybe I won't because technically today is not supposed to be included in the vlog. Today is really just supposed to be... Sundays are usually my relax day and I usually start the vlog on Mondays. So you know what? No, I'm not going to include that in the, in the vlog because again, I just want today to be a super, super chill day. So you guys saw my entire week. You saw my party yesterday. So today is my birthday. Happy birthday to me. And this is where I'm actually going to end the vlog and I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right. Bye guys.